understand how to use tools group the tools group has many tools that have different functions these tools help us in making drawings to use any tool in the tools group simply click on it the tool will be selected move the pointer to the drawing area Press and hold down the left mouse button. Now drag the mouse to draw a picture. When the picture is complete, release the button. Students, let me give you a tip. To know the name of a tool, place the pointer on that tool. Pencil tool the pencil tool is used to draw free form lines or curves. Select the pencil tool from the tools group. Select any color from the colors group. Move the pointer to the drawing area. Press and hold down the left mouse button and drag the pointer to draw kites as shown in the figure. Adding text. Click on the text tool. The pointer changes to eye shape. Click and drag the pointer on the drawing area where you want to place the text. A dotted rectangular box will appear with a blinking cursor inside it. Type the text as shown in the text box. Eraser tool. The eraser tool is used to erase any part of a picture. Select the eraser tool from the tools group. Choose the size of the eraser by clicking on the desired option in the size button menu. A square will appear in the drawing area. Hold down the left mouse button and move it on the area that you want to erase. Brush tool Brush tool is used to draw objects with different kinds of brushes. To use it, click on the brushes drop down arrow. Select any brush type from the list of available options. Select any color from the colors group. Move the pointer to the drawing area. Press and hold down the left mouse button and drag the mouse to draw different lines. Using airbrush tool. Airbrush tool is used to spray color on the drawing area. Select any color from the colors group. Click on the brushes drop down arrow and select the airbrush option. Select the desired spray size from the size button. Move the mouse pointer onto the drawing area. Click the mouse button on the area where you want to spray the color. Students know that in the same manner, you can make use of other brushes. Let us understand how to edit the existing file. Select tool. The select tool is used to select any part of the picture that we want to change. Click on the select tool on the image group. 
Bring the mouse pointer over the object that is to be selected. Click and hold down the left mouse button and then drag around the outer boundary of the object. Release the mouse button when it is completely selected. Resizing or screwing the picture. The size of the picture can be increased or decreased vertically or horizontally. Select the drawing by covering its boundary using the Select tool. Click on any of its corners. The resizing handle will appear. Hold the left mouse button and drag the handle inward to decrease the size. Drag outward to increase the size. How to save the drawing? It is important to save your work at short intervals so that you do not lose it in case of power failure. Click on the paint button and select the save option. The save as window appears on the screen. Type a name in the file name box. Click on the save button. Now your drawing is saved in the computer. Now let us learn how to close paint window. In order to close the paint window, click on the close button placed at the top right corner of the window or click on the paint button and select the exit option. Students, let me tell you how to open the saved drawing. The drawing that you have saved can be opened anytime. To open a saved drawing, first open paint by clicking on the start, then all programs, then accessories, then paint. Click on the paint button and select the open option. The open window appears. Select the location where the file is saved. Select the file name that you have saved from the list. Click on the open button. You will find the same drawing. 